So we're going to ask you some questions about your teammates. Um, so we want you to reveal all. Yeah. I think Mike's been really good actually recently. The yeah. German. Yeah. Uh -huh. He's a left back, but I mean, last week in practice he <laughs> had a small side of Drew and he was scoring more goals than all of us forwards. So. Skillful. The most technical is definitely Juan. He's got, he's in small spaces, his touches and everything. I, he's probably the most skillful player, I think. Most technical, at least. That's Hernandez or? Juan Hernandez, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we'll drop the second. The other Juan just eats a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's also a very good center back. The Joker is Lima, although sometimes not everyone understands him. And I often have to translate for him, but I would say Lima. He's, I mean, he's 31, but <laughs> he's, He's jokes around more than any of us. He's something else. <laughs> uh, worst dressed. I don't know. Probably say myself. Always walking <laughs> sandals, flip flops. I don't. <laughs> I'm just coming to train. <laughs> mm, I think Juan Sanchez. Juan Sanchez. It looks quiet a bit, yeah. but he's a tough guy. Farns actually did walk by him the other day and uh, accidentally brushed into his shoulder and kind of bounced yeah. off him. You know, he said he's 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 pretty, pretty, pretty big guy. He's always at the gym, always eating. So I'm sure that yeah. <laughs> that gives him some <laughs> some strength. The keg. The keg. Yeah. Yeah. We brought it back to Chattanooga and hopefully we'll stay here forever. So. Yeah. <laughs> So, I mean, it's been noticed on social media that you're particularly close to the keg, you know? Yeah, Katie caught me hugging the keg after we won it, so everyone seemed to love that. Uh, Humberto and Juan Hernandez again. Humberto's already guy's goalkeeping academy, and he put up videos the other day. He's a great goalkeeper coach. And then Juan as well, he's already got his team. Yep. He's got two teams in Pensacola, I think, and he coaches at UWF. And also, I mean, Luke and uh, Carrier, they're also coaches up here. And you can tell that on the field as well, you know, by the leadership and, and by how they talk and speak to us. So I think the three of them, four of them actually. I mean, my car is Charlie, for sure. Charlie, I mean. What's Charlie, what's Charlie listening to these days? Everything. Yeah. Yeah, his playlist is, it goes from the old school, not old school, like not way back, but you know, the 2000s, the, R&Bs and hip hops, and then he also plays my favorite as well, the Post Malone's new, so um, new album, okay. Bear Bungs and Bentley. Okay. But uh, you, I'm not that familiar with that. Maybe could you, could you let us know? Sing. What that <laughs> right, yeah. If you were a Chatter hooligan, stood in section 209, and you were watching the team right now, who would be the player that you'd be watching the most? Juan. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone loves Juan, doesn't mm -hmm. they? Yeah. But is it, is it the hair or is it more? The hair oh, too. Okay. It's because he doesn't look like he'll be good, but. <laughs> I thought he was a surfer when I first met him, but uh, <laughs> the energy I would say Pierre. Pierre definitely runs all game long. I don't know how, but Pierre has definitely got the most energy on the field. And he's also great with the ball at his feet, but in terms of energy, and then him and Juan. I already talked about Juan. But. The one that's impressed me a lot is uh, Caitlin, center back, number five. I mean, we, we all know this just because she wins everything in the air. She's good coming out, you know, from the back. And then I also like the forwards as well. I mean, Summer, she's been here for a few years. She played, I mean, she played against my school. I've seen her play a few times and I play the same position as me. So I really like how she plays. You're looking at him. Oh, wow. It's me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, ask Pierre. <laughs> <laughs> Who'd you play as? Watch, watch, watch France team. against Brazil. Oh, really? Yeah, he beat me the third game because I was playing Portugal, he was playing with Belgium, but okay. the, the France-Brazil game, I yeah. definitely had him on you that. Got, you yeah. got some mad skills? Yeah, I got yeah. some skills. <laughs> we recently won a game uh, against Asheville, yeah. and I personally call it the Blue Ridge Derby, uh, but how do you pronounce it? Blue Ridge Classical. Oh, hey. The new way, to, new way to say it, <laughs> new go. way to no call it. There you go. That yet. Okay, <laughs> awesome. Next season. There you go. Blue Next Ridge season. There you go. There Gotta is. have a Spanish version of it. Yeah. Joao. Joao? Yeah. yeah. Where he's from in Brazil, they're, they're, that's what they're famous for, barbecue. And I mean, at the house, 
he, the guys always call him dad because I mean especially my apartment he cooks us lunch and dinner every time I think Soren long distance yeah short distance probably mirrors Rome to be honest but long distance I think Soren this I mean my favorite part is definitely the being around the teammates and how how everyone treats us here I mean with I, I tell everyone and no one believes me that Chattanooga is a special place like starting with the fans the club I mean everywhere we go people always, I've never had any problems here everyone goes above and beyond to get us what we need and uh, I think that's the best thing about Chattanooga the community aspect of it